Hey, everyone out there in uh, YouTube land and cyber world and all that fun shit. This is Christopher Williams, uh, YouTube user Drum God PC3. Over the last year or so, I've had a bunch of people ask me questions about my kit and what gear I use and all that fun stuff. So I thought I would take you on an updated tour of my kit. So here we go. The first rack tom is a 7x8 pearl reference. And Comet Sparkle, that's right, believe it or not, no, I did not acquire a spare badge. I'm uh, not that type of dude. That's pretty lame. Anyway, this is a one-off product that I was fortunate enough to get my hands on. I uh, caught word of it through a good friend of mine, friend of the family, and uh, he helped me out. So, thanks, buddy. Anywho, moving on. Uh, next to that, we've got the 8x10 and the 9x12 rack toms. Uh, Pearl's reference series Scarlet Fade, which I believe is number 155. Running two 18x22 kicks. I have D6 microphones in there. Uh, running some EV mics on the rack toms. Over here on the floors, I'm running a 14x14 and 16x16 using some Beta 52s on there. They sound badass. You should get some. Over here on the left side of my kit, I have the 10x13 rack tom from my Ludwig Zebra kit, which many of you have probably seen in the video I did of Seven Dust Song Praise. 6x10 Firecracker. Uh, as you can tell, some of my gear is missing. It's actually packed up and on the road headed to a show where I will catch up with the band in a few days. So normally, I'm running a 14-inch Peisty, or not Peisty, Meinl uh, Classics China. Sorry about that. Um, pair of 14-inch MB20 hi-hats with two bottoms. Uh, I used to work at the company, so I was able to acquire those. 12-inch um, Z Custom Splash. 19-inch Z Custom Medium, 19-inch Z Custom Rock Crash. I normally have a 6-inch A Custom Splash right there, but that is out with my road kit as well. 6-inch Zilbel, 21-inch Z Custom Mega Bell, Peisty FX China. It's either FX or Alpha, I don't remember. Uh, PST, sorry. Bought that over the summer and... Uh, Sounds damn good for only being 80 bucks. Uh, back here, what is this? This is a 17 inch Peisty Sound Formula Full Crash. A pair of Byzance 14 inch dark hi hat bottoms. Yes, both bottoms. I prefer the heavier cymbals and the naturally higher pitch. 8 inch chrome rock cowbell from Meinl. 9.5 inch Z Custom Zill Bell back here. Uh, and it is all supported on my level riser rack system, which uh, you can order them from Tony Ramirez. Just go to levelrack.com. It's pretty sweet. It's not up on the legs right now, um, but as you can see, the kick drums are hanging suspended, believe it or not, using the 15 and 16 inch depth Pearl Opti mounts that I slightly modified to widen them for the tension rods back here. Uh, I'm using the Pearl PCX 1000 and 2000 or 100 or 200 clamps. Omniball Tom mounts everywhere. I prefer the, uh, the Unilock and the Gyro Lock symbol holders. Um, what else? I prefer to run Evans Clear G1s on the bottoms and coated G2s on the batters. Um, and I will usually go back and forth between either a Power Stroke 3 on the kick heads or just one of the, uh, the two-ply EMAD systems. Oh, snare drum. This would be the 6.5 by 14 Pearl Eric Singer model. Let's see if I can get a shot of the logo. Uh, might be able to see that. Anyway, I, uh, as you can see, I have outfitted it with black hardware. Um, I don't know, didn't want the, the standard finish, so to speak, standard setup. But uh, anyway, that's my kit. 
uh, Vader Fusions or 3A Fatbacks or the uh, what are they the uh, the LA's yeah LA Fatbacks or the Manhattan Jazz Sticks or the Virgil Donati's great tips nice taper good stick anyway that's my kit and uh, thanks for checking it out have a good one